le dije adiós. What's up, everybody? Happy Saturday. I am on the freeway here in Phoenix, Arizona. I'm on my way to the Phoenix Falcons Fencing Club, and I get a lot of questions from those of you who know nothing about fencing. Um, what does this look like? What is this sport all about? And I just thought I would take you on my average Saturday, not my average Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday when I'm at the club in the gym, but just Saturday mornings when the when the team gets together and we just have a good time. So here I am, of course, makeup free, still got bags because I'm tired from, from Thursday night practice and Friday everything else, but guess what? This is the real and the raw. We don't have room for makeup at fencing because you're gonna sweat it out. So anyway, here I am. I will catch you guys in a couple seconds once we finally get to the club and uh, let's get it on. Okay, we made it, but we're running late. So let's go ahead and let everybody in the door. Hey guys. The I-10 sucks. Good morning, good morning. The I-10 sucks. It closed like four different locations. So my apologies, Jogu. You fit that right. You fit that energy. We all one. One love. This is Coach Phil. Say hi, Coach Phil. Hi, Coach Phil. <laughs> So this is Phil. Phil takes all of his precious energy and time to try to train me into something worth watching. So I appreciate him. So why do you love fencing so much? I love fencing so much because you can really be yourself out there. You can really get into the warrior mindset that you don't get in day-to-day -day life. And you get to carve out, you, you have to, it's a one-on-one -on -one sport. You have to carve out your own little space. And I love doing that. How long have you been fencing? 20 years. I've been fencing for 20 years. 20 years, and he's probably 21. So. <laughs> add, a, add a few to that, but yeah, close enough. Oh my gosh. And what do you love about coaching students? Uh, I love when they look back at me and they, when, it, when something works, and they look back at me and they say, they say, yeah. Really, when you finally listen, it works, huh? Yeah. Hopefully we'll get to see him out there in action today, but if not, I'm telling you, amazing human being, couldn't do it without him, so thank you, Coach Phil. You're welcome, Georgia. <laughs> Great, thank you. So talk to us, how long have you been fencing? Ooh, I've been fencing since I was, I did a summer camp at Phoenix Falcons in fifth grade. And I'm currently 29, so many years. <laughs> what do you love so much about fencing? I love one, that it's intergenerational. So especially for younger fencers, you get to interact with people who are like older and just not, not who you usually interact with in school. So you learn a lot, not just about fencing athletics, but also intellectually. It expands you in so many ways. And it's just a very fun sport. It's incredibly unique. So if you're going to college, if you are applying for anything, it's a great way to make you stand out. Ah, so tell me something. Here's yeah. the top question. What is this picture of you all about? Oh my gosh, this is when I got second place at a North American Cup, a NAC. Uh, my sister was my coach. So she is my best friend and the best coach ever. And um, yeah, I used to get some medals here and there. No big deal. I've taken a few years off, but I'm coming back at the end of 2024. You got that right. You hear that when she's coming back. Watch yes. out, Div 2. Watch out, Div 1A. Yes. Here we come. Exactly. <laughs> Thanks, Jerica. Thank you. All right, get that jump rope going. Let's go. Let's get that warm up going. That's what I'm talking about. Get that warm up. Get that warm up.
the opportunity to take you in so you can see a little bit of what we do I'm on my way to go eat I am actually finally hungry <laughs> I didn't eat very much this morning I was too excited to get out here but yeah hope that you enjoyed a day in the life or at least a Saturday in the life of us fencers but um, if you have any questions just let me know um, and maybe we'll take you to a tournament next time all right go Falcons